For question number 17, DG and EF are equal since DEFG is an isosceles trapezoid, which means the arc DG would be equal to the arc EF. So we have DG is equal to EF. Now the measure of the entire circle would be 360 degrees. And we can say that it's a sum of 70, 170 and the two arcs DG and EF. So we can write that as an equation where 170 degrees plus 70 degrees plus DG plus EF is equal to 360 degrees. Now 170 plus 70 gives us 240 plus DG is equal to EF. So 2 times DG is equal to 360. 2 DG is equal to 360 minus 240 which is 120. And finally, dg is equal to 120 divided by 2, which is nothing but 60 degrees. And this is our final measure, which is given by option D.